What's going on? My name is Kyle Harris, aka Racer GT399. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time to do race number 21 to 36 on the NASCAR Heat 3 Season West Play. I'm here at Pocono Raceway, runoff of the Gender Outdoors 400, qualify 11. So last race, we win our eighth win in the seat of the NASCAR Heat 3 West Play. Can we go back to back wins and ninth win in the, in the NASCAR Heat 3 West Play? We're about to find out. So here we go. We're here in Pocono Raceway, runoff of the Gender Outdoors 400. Corey Wajoy doesn't have doesn't doesn't have a good practice season. Austin Dillon give up qualifying, starting all the way in the back. William Byron starting all the way in the back, and looks like we're going to be qualified 11. So, all right, guys, race number 21 to 36. We're here in the Tricky Triangle in Pocono. Green flag, run away here in Pocono. Look at this, got a huge run. Oh my gosh. Three wide for for fifth or fourth. Harvick. Now we're going three wide again. Waiting to the lead, by the way. See who's gonna lead the first lap here in Pocono. Could be Ryan Blaney or Martrex Jr. And off turn three and four. Looks like Ryan Blaney is going to lead the first lap here in Pocono. Still contact me for Martrex Jr. for second. Ten to go. Here I come. Got a huge run for the lead. Here we go. New leader in Pocono. Gotta say, qualify 11th and now to the lead once. Now to the lead in Pocono. I say the toughest part. The toughest part is uh, the fuel mosh. By the way, you know. So we're gonna try our best to uh, not to make any mistakes. So doing a good job. You got Blaney, you got Harvick, Kurt Busch, and Kyle Larson, and yeah, in the top five. Oh boy, I almost hit the wall. Nine to go in Pocono. Kurt Busch is in second place right now. Who's in third? Larson in third? Kyle Larson? And we're down the long pond straight away right there, guys. So... So we don't know when I'm gonna come down the pit road. So maybe I'll do it around like the next couple of laps. I believe we'll do that. Oh, I guess never mind then. <laughs> Caution just came out. I, I was about to say that I might have a chance to go to the next on the final lap to go down to get tires and fuel, but all, all of a sudden, caution just came out. That's what I just need. All right, I probably know I'm gonna be starting all the way in the back because of the soil pit stop, but it doesn't matter because we got a fast race car anyway. So, all right, that's what I need a caution by the way to get tires and fuel. So yes. So anyway, green flag back to the air. I, first of all, I don't know who brought out the caution by the way, but it doesn't matter. Oh, I got a huge run on the inside. Look at this. Going three wide over the 13 and 11. So, made it through three wide. Now I'm in 13th. Trying to get to the top 10. Oh, man. Don't want to hit the infield grass. We don't want to do that. Now here comes Alex Bowman on the inside. Now I'm stuck on the outside. Oh man, I'm, yeah, I'm stuck on the outside. Getting the draft on the outside, it's been looking good, so. How many laps to go we got? We got four to go. We can might have a chance to make it up there or not. 
Who's in the lead? I think that's Kiswowski up there. Brad Kiswowski. Here I come for fourth over Kyle Busch. Can I get the third? Yes, I do. Up the third. Getting a huge run. Look at this. Big run. Going for second over Kevin Harvick. Oh, got a little, little tight there, but going three wide for second. Oh, no. I'm stuck in the middle. Made it through the middle. How about that? Wow. I don't know how that I did that. That was amazing. All right. Now I'm in second. Can I reel in Brad Keselowski with three laps to go in Pocono? Getting the draft on the number two car of Brad Keselowski. I'm going to try to race on the outside. Oh, look at this. We're racing on the outside. Keselowski on the inside. Side by side for the lead. Can I get him on the outside? Yes, I do. Look at this. Back to the lead once again after I had a slow pit stop. Oh, never mind. Car's getting a little tight. And then, yeah, now Kiswowski's back in the lead. I think it's going to be a good race, by the way. It's going to be a fantastic finish. Hit the back bumper up the two of Brad Kiswowski. And he's going to hit the wall. And back to the lead once again. Gotta say, it's a bump and run for the lead, guys. How about that? Two to go. Now here comes who's going for second. Kyle Busch going for second over Brad Keswowski. I'm gonna to try to stay focused right now, so. Gotta say, this... Could we have a chance to go back to back? We're about to find out. Got a fast race car body. We qualified 11th, 11th, and now might might have a chance to go back to back wins and ninth win of the season. If I don't make any mistake, by the way. Yeah, we got a fast race car. All right, here we go. Off to the turn number four. White flag in the air. One more time around in Pocono. Gotta say, car's been fast all day after a slow pit stop all the way in the back. Got a great race car. A caution saved it. That way, because I don't have to worry about going to pit road to get tires and fuel. Down the long pond straight away for the final time here in Pocono. Kyle Busch in second. Brad Keswowski third. Kurt Busch in fourth, and Kevin Harvick, the top five. And it looks like we're going to do it, guys. Yes, we do. Off turn three and four. Looks like we're going back to back wins. And we're going to win the ninth win of the NASCAR Heat 3 Season West play at Pocono. Woo! How about that? Back to back wins and ninth win in the season. Look at that, guys. Ninth win of the season. How about that? And back to back wins. We're gonna stop right around right here. I gotta say, that was a lot of fun, by the way. That was a lot of fun in Pocono. So, we got the W, ninth win of the, of the, the NASCAR Heat 3 Season West play, and back-to-back -back wins. So, and it's time to go to Victor Wayne to celebrate back-to-back uh, -back wins and ninth win of the season. We won at Pocono. I gotta love that trophy, by the way, with the Eagle, e Eagle trophy. That is so cool. How about that, guys? Back-to-back -back wins. I gotta love that the trophy with the eagle on it. That is so cool. Alright, we're gonna see what the next race is gonna be for race number 22. So, we'll be right back. So, the next race is gonna be for race number 22, the 36, ladies and gentlemen. It's gonna be Watkins Glen International, run up of the goldboeing.com at the Glen. So, guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. By the way, ladies and gentlemen, hit the like, hit the subscribe button, click the bell notification, turn it on. If you guys are new on here, ladies and gentlemen, we're on road to 4,000 subscribers very soon. And also, we're on road to 1,000 subscribers. I love you all the bottom of my heart, ladies and gentlemen. Don't forget to keep it red. I love you. Have a nice day. See you guys next time. Have an awesome day. See you guys soon. Keep it red, Jet. Have a great day.